Today, I present to you all the gods of Smash Ultimate. Now, what exactly allows anyone to be chosen as a god in this game? Well, I'll tell you. It isn't your current title or your tournament winnings or what your win-loss ratio might be. No, all that allows you to be a god at this game is to be personally trained by moi and uh, to have the most busted stats imaginable. Yes. I'm talking about amiibos, and here are the reigning amiibos that govern all of existence, right in the palm of my hand. This story starts in a distant plane, in a virtual system of bouts, very similar to what we have today. I'm talking 2014 Smash 4, where you didn't have to worry about rampant NFTs, OnlyFans didn't exist, and Markiplier was beginning his triumphant reign over animatronics. You see, it was December 2014 that a very special amiibo made its way into my hands and became the precursor to all of the events to unfold around me. That would be the Link amiibo I currently possess today. In time, I began collecting more and more of these figurines. Ryu was next, followed by Bowser, and then Samus, and so on and so forth. The gods presented to you today have likely been subjected to millions of battles for almost 10 years. That's a long ass time. <laughs> they have a gene pool of experience to share, and many tricks up their sleeves. At least, they did. You see, troubling as it may be, sometimes you need a fresh start to feel happier in life. I told you I collected many amiibos, which I did, and nearly all of them had their memories erased once I transferred over to Smash Ultimate. Of the five gods, these included Link and Samus, however, Bowser and Ryu are still the same, retaining those blessed memories from long ago. Ever since I started collecting amiibos, it was my goal to create and train the strongest, most capable fighters to exist in Smash Bros. history, and now, I finally have a place to display my endeavors with each and every one of you. That's what this has all been about. Take yourself back 10 years and ask yourself how you've changed and what it all means for you. Have you accomplished anything you've wanted to? For me, I am far from it. I've always dreamed and dreamed of being like my idols, take Markiplier, the Vanos gaming crew, Game Grumps, Alpharad, you name him. And uh, now I'm finally here, in the hot seat. I'm ready more than ever to start something revolutionary that people can look back on. Think about it. From the level 9 tournaments to Alpharad's, you know, Henry Stickman collection to you know, just everything, like every piece of gaming culture around us, just think about it, take it all in. I wanna be a part of that. And from one dreamer to another, let's help each other. I hope you'll join me. Cause that's what this is all about. Anyway, um, I'm gonna get my ass kicked next time I do a, a row to 50. It's gonna be severe, but it's official. It's coming. These are your gods of Smash Ultimates.